Greetings, boys and girls. I am Jack Dion from ZL Entertainment, and today we have my very first video for first impressions. I got this idea from Drifty of Driftwood Gaming, and I thought that it would be a good idea to start with his game. I watched his, um, like, let's make a game series, which is kind of odd to see since. I like to say I'm the one who created it six years ago since I was looking for such a series and there never was one so I made one of my own but I digress slightly I thought it would be a good idea to try his game out and yes I did see the let's make a game series as I mentioned earlier uh, but that was last year and I can't quite remember anything of the game now as you can see there is a continue button and that is because I tried recording this video once before and it was just froth with difficulties let's go with that so basically with these first impression videos I will be given my first impression of a video game that you guys make whether it be on the RPG maker engine preferably MV or VXA's but I will also do other game engines. That's something I haven't seen Drifty do. And I, I think William the Unpro Pro has done a few first impressions, but not much. And none of them have done other game engines. I will be willing to do other game engines. Um, like I said, preferably, uh, preferably RPG Maker MV, VXAs, or... Unreal Engine 4. Those are my preferences, but I will do first impressions for any game engine. So without further ado, that was a slightly longer intro than I wanted, but I wanted to get out of the way before the I started the game. Let's start the game and see what we get. General, we are nearly there. The town's militia will pose no threat to our army. The only thing I can see so far is the map is lacking. And the words could have fit all on one line, so I don't know what that was about. I'm sure there was a reason for it, but... Good. See to it that everything goes to plan. Yes, sir! So I always liked the cool events where every character moves at the same time. I always thought that was cool. Oh cool, the wa little pond is bubbling. I always liked that, but now looking back on it, I'm thinking maybe it would be cool if one was kind of like straggling behind because not everybody walks the same speed. How's dinner? It's fine. Mm-hmm. I suppose I wouldn't expect you to be excited over the same meal over and over. Not at all. It's still good. At least we're not starving. That's not something everyone in this town can say. Indeed. You're a sweet girl. No. Oh, okay. If you want, we can give some of this away. I think we have more than needed. All right. Let's see if the old man is hungry. Mm-hmm. All right, after we finish dinner, we'll go check on him. Old men are only hungry for little girls. <laughs> what was that? Stay here and hide. I'll go check. You should check around for hidden supplies before continuing. As usual. Yay. I have found that the Phoenix Brew is the most needed item so far. I just tried playing this Friday and I still forgot where everything is at. Not everything, but most. That looks like there's a head in that little. this thing right here. Okay, moving on. Tiana! Get back in the house and pack your things. We have to leave. What's going on? Uh, 
I will never do the same voice for the same character more than once. It's just how the donut rolls. General, we've found her! Alright. With this first sight, fight, not sight. Yeah. The best thing to do on this is just spam the attack for these guys. That's all that's needed. <sighs> it's really difficult to do a first impressions if the first video freaking messes up on you. That was a very quick level up. They have come here looking for you. There's not much... There's much we must discuss, but now is not the time. We need to escape through the sewers. For me? Why me? What about the people of this town? What will happen to them? There's nothing else we can do. We have to exit through the sewers as fast as we can. And it's probably one thing I will do. If I see, like, colored text, I'll just read it weirdly. There are many optional fights spread throughout the game. If you wish to test your might, you can explore the town and pick up some extra supplies. There are hidden secrets everywhere. Be careful, though, as you might end up in a hard battle. The though is missing the UGH. You can change the music by pressing the weird button. You can zoom the camera with the minus button on the numpad. You can open the items menu with the I. You can equip... You can equip menu with the... You can open the equip menu with the U. With you. You can open the skill menu with K. You can open the status menu with T. You can auto-optimize the party's equipment with the equal sign. Swiftly moving on. Firewood. Anything here? I already forgot. Hmm. Whenever you see a chest, you know there's got to be something there. Yeah, so I can't really remember much of the tutorial that he did. So I will be, like, forgetting a lot of stuff. I do remember, uh, the general down here. I do remember it's an optional battle, and it's not too difficult. If I had freaking equipped my stuff first. This is one thing I don't really like, is the ability to equip stuff during the, uh, the fight itself. It, it's like, it's almost as if the character's like, hold on a minute guys, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta equip my stuff, I gotta equip my stuff, oh no! And they're like, okay, yeah. Go on, equip your stuff, we'll wait here for you, you know, we're, we're kind evil villains, so that's what it always feels like to me. But I'm going to do it because I forgot. Now with this fight, it is not good to continually just attack. <laughs> Except for, for her. She's mostly on, uh, I will have her mostly as a healer. We need to get him more criticals. Drift needs more critical. Heal her. Nice. Yeah. 
One thing I hate is when the enemies attack only one person at a time. But we need to get the general down. Because if I remember right, he will revive his enemies. Which is not, not good at all. Good thing I uh, healed myself. Alright. Heal her up because she's about to die. Need a critical, man. Come on, do criticals. I hate this move. Nice. I like to get where there's only one there at least. And have her attack him. And then he can focus on the general. Nice! Critical! Nice. Oh, come on, don't pick on the same person. It's not fair! Yes! That was faster than the first time I tried that. <laughs> Alright, let's continue. Anti-venom is alright. Those offensive and defensive stances don't really help much. What are you Yurix doing coming to the aid of the general? Who? Yurix? We must escape to the sewers now. And they don't even run there. That's, um, hmm. Should have ran there. Now, I remember the sewers being difficult. Either I just, I, I'll, I'll say it right now. I, number one thing I hate the most in RPG games, it's the reason why I could never play Final Fantasy. When I was a kid, I never even heard of it. I wasn't into those kind of games. And when I tried playing Final Fantasy, it was on an emulator, and it was very original, it was terrible graphics, and it had something I absolutely hated. And it's called Random Encounters. I hate Random Encounters more than anything else in any game. I could write a whole song about it. 
And if you gotta have random encounters, then make it, you'll probably see like 20 different random encounters. I might cut them all out, except for maybe one of them. to get see that in another few steps I'm surprised I expected another one it'll probably happen after this no maybe if I pretend like it's gonna keep happening it won't happen because that's how like stuff happens if you say something's gonna happen it won't and vice versa so it's gonna happen soon Damn it. Thought I was on to something there. I'm pleasantly surprised. Let's keep up those criticals, Mr. Driftwood. Another one? I'll oh, damn you to hell. Oh, uh, there it is. Okay. That's acceptable. That is acceptable. Oh, damn it. Alright. Alrighty. And you can't escape these. I tried. I, I sat in a row trying to escape a certain fight and I just wouldn't even fight. I almost died because I just tried to escape like 20 different times and it just, it wasn't happening. Your powers are weak, Tiana! Slightly better, but not much. Just spam attack for now, it doesn't matter. Told ya. Alright, yep, 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 yep. See what I mean? I didn't hit select, that's cool too. battle is really bothering me. Now with this, uh, you can go two different ways. And if you want, you could actually get the gold in that room, and then go over this room and get the gold. And get double. But with all the random encounters, I'm not going to do that. This is why it took me half an hour in the last video to get through this area. If that happened more often, I wouldn't be... 
I wouldn't be all iffy about this area. What was that? We have to hurry, keep your eyes peeled. Something's not right. Yep, not gonna do that one again. Let's make sure we got everything optimized. And then we're going to have her heal us. And then we're going to go to items. And we are going to... Yeah, that's the one. This is why I don't like when my videos mess up on first impressions. I can't give a full first impressions on something if I already played it. But, you know, whatever. Hopefully this video won't mess up. Oh, and make sure you save your game in this game. Because I didn't do that the first time and it wasn't a fun time. Yeah, let's try that. Oh, couldn't see that one coming. Who's... Oh, three level 11s and two 9s. Let's take the 9s out first, I guess. Oh, come on. You couldn't get rid of it one right away. Alright. Have her get rid of his Venom. It's an anti... Or, not anti, but... What did they call it? Instant cast. So I can do that and then I can heal him. Do not pick on her again. God damn it. Alright, let's see, what should we do now? Tech, of course. Got that gone. Let's heal her. Good one. Mm, he has enough of that, so, so we can use that. She going offensive? It doesn't really matter much. Too bad that's not an instant cast. I don't really like that taking a turn. And I could have that on her too, I think. I'll put her on defensive. Oh, I can't. That would have been nice. So close. Finally. Can handle two, so let's get her the anti-venom and then he'll uh, heal him uh, and yeah tech it up Much easier this time. Five skills just going through this. 
Indeed, hot rock. I don't know if these switches do anything, but I still pull them. That's what she said. Aw, oh, damn it all. Her powers are really weak. There they go again, picking on her. Nice. Good thing I did that. Ah, critical from her. How nice. Two crits in a row, that's uh, kind of rare. Wow. Six levels in the very first little cave dungeon area, that's a bit too much. Might, you know, whatever. Might be a small game, must be. If you can gain six levels in the first area. Alright. Let's do a few things here. Namely, healing everybody. That's close enough. Oh, no more. Okay. And now we need some items. So, for her. Um, we got strong juice. We only have two Phoenix Brews. There's one time when I had four. So that would have been nice. We got some of that. Fresh in water, that will help. This might be able to help, I don't know. Does nothing. Nothing, 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 nothing. Alright, we do have a few good things. And now let's, uh... Optimize our equipment. Okay, nothing. Nothing. Alright. Is that really true? We have nothing. Yeah, that is true. Hot rock must be something, uh... Oh, and definitely safe here. And let's go for it. This will be difficult. Very difficult. Yep. Okay, watch this. I forgot about this tech. Oh, he doesn't have enough. Now you will. Damn it all. Okay, now watch it. Because it only works. Stores TP, adds Sagan, adds a shield that absorbs 500 damage. But I believe you can only do it if you have a certain percentage of health. Nope, I guess not. I thought you did. Wait, what? Oh wow, I didn't add nothing. Will that help? Okay, better. Nice. She actually did a critical. Awesome. Is that for that? I don't know if that will... It does! Awesome! 
And then we'll just uh, attack. And he is on a offensive, which means he does more damage. So that's good. That wasn't much. Of course, now he has no tech to do that one strike, so that kind of sucks. I could probably drink that one potion, but I don't know. There's only one of it. I might just do that. Oh, I do have three of them. So that's not too bad. Now we can do it. That was very anticlimactic. Not very good skill there, but you know, whatever. Critical? Damn it. I'm just waiting for him to get the critical. That's all that matters with uh, Drift here. Yep, that's all that matters, as you can see. Ooh, two criticals in a row. Damn, that's nice. Okay, she's gonna need... Nope, not that one. It's the anti-venom. I don't know what the other one is. I don't think I have a way to get rid of it. So, give her some health. And, yep, good idea. Yes! Almost got this guy. Awesome. As he slowly devolves into the ground. Not bad, not bad. I got a fish from that too. <laughs> Tina, are you okay? You're hurt. Dot dot dot. There's a castle to the north of this tunnel exit. I'm gonna take you there and get you patched up. Actually, I think Drift was actually more hurt in that battle, but uh, you know, whatevs. Meanwhile. Hmm, this is some unusual weather. It's all sunny. Sir Arturus, the kingdom is under attack. Attack from who? It's the Crimson Dawn Empire, sir. They've attacked the castle. And what's worse, they appear to be working side by side with the Eurex. I was sent here to summon you back to the castle as soon as we were struck. We can't be true. We have signed a peace treaty with the Crimson Dawn Empire. Eurix, we have agreed to work together to slay the beast men. This makes no sense. Has Cain sent you here to get me rattled? I grow tired of his six jokes. <clears throat> I hurt the voice a little bit more than I thought I would, so I'll just do normal. Sir Arturus, I wish this were a prank. I'm afraid it's true. I attest to the validity of my statement, sir. I saw the beastmen with my own eyes. As I drew my blade to defend the castle, our lord, uh, Lord Macau, which is from the Witcher, himself sent me to gather you. That's not the only thing to report. They have brought necromancers with them. Necromancers? That magic has been forbidden for ages. 
I was asked to deliver this artifact to you as well. This will prevent them from using instant doom magic on you. Don't forget to equip it, sir. You obtained an ancient skull. I believe you, soldier. Oh, no. Let's make haste to the Coral Castle. Coral Castle sounds like something that would be in, like, Super Mario Brothers or something. Sir. Now, this is the weird thing. When you start a new party member, like this has done, the inventory that we had with the other people are still with us, and that's the weirdest thing ever. The only thing that this guy should have right now is a few things along with This. So sadly, if I remember right, yeah, none of these tents you can go into. Looking that way, can't climb up that. I didn't even know that. Now I'm going to be going to everything and being like, Oh, is it here? Is there one here? Now I believe there's something in here. This is about as far as I got last time. Because last time, I spent about an hour and a half recording last time, and I got this far. That's how terrible that one, like, sewer dungeon area was for me. Like, it took me half an hour in there. Feylacon? What? This is the same map that he's working on, because I'm watching his current Let's Make a Game. I need to really start working on mine again. And this looks exactly like the same. Oh, I love this music. This is Chrono Trigger music. Uh, so happy. Not this time, though. No. Oh, it's a Nork. Of course. Not too bad. So we'll just spam attack with this guy too, unless his health gets too low. In which case, I'll just have a strong brew. Oh wait, what's this? Oh, nice, I like that. I didn't see that last time. Awesome. So last time I was going to check out the rust ham sewers, but I'm not going to this time. Just a moment. Hmm, I love it. Chrono Trigger, the best RPG game that was made in the 90s. Besides Elder Scrolls. Ah, it's an orc. They call them Yurix in the game. Okay, that's what they are. Okay. Uh, I want to check out the tech. Blade Rush. Ooh. That one's a nice one. I don't want to keep using that every time. Actually, I'll check it out in this battle and see if it returns in every battle. Maybe you can only use it once. Let's see.
Nice. Mm. Doesn't return. Okay. Well, it's nice to know that now. And the lip doesn't stay the same, so that's sad. The travesty, alright. And all the effects do not stay, so... I don't know if that's possible to do in the game engine anyway, but that would be cool if there was. So you need a certain amount of something to get that Valor. Alright. I won't use it yet. I will have a strong juice. Nice. Be cool if you could. Alright, time to see if uh, anything hidden. That's a good way to block stuff off. I do it all the time. That's all I know it's a good way to do it. Nice sh shadow. Added shadow. Because I know this map. One thing I will say, and it's a huge, um, huge advice that I said last video, but I forgot to say it earlier. Take pre-made maps like this and just edit it, edit the hell out of it, make it your own, that's what you need to do. I forgot to save last time and I died on the first time I did the video. This time I'm going to save. This is all new to me for now, so I'm, I'm liking that. Uh, but yeah, take pre-made maps, edit them so much that people are like, because I've edited maps so well that people are like, I like your ma map you made, and I'm like, I just took a map, pre-made map, and I edited it, made my own, made it my own, English, people, English, and that's what I did, and so you can do that, this is pre-made maps, but if you edited it, maybe take out the statue, then, I thought that was one of our guys take stuff like statues out and replace it with other things take other areas out and just stuff like that do so I might do a tutorial on that I might if enough people want to see it I probably will I might do it anyways but it would take a longer time let's do a tech right away now let's do a nice valor right away Sometimes I don't keep a check on my health, that's honestly what I do sometimes, just completely forget. So, yeah, almost uh, died there because I completely forgot to check that out. But we got it in the end, so that's, you know, that's good stuff. That was some good guitar, damn you, Yurik. I was listening to that guitar work. Let's get Night Valor on. And then just tech it on up. Do that twice, and uh... Yeah, nice. Aw, uh, the shield is gone. Nice.
It's weird that he has battle backgrounds. That's one thing I don't like doing is adding battle backgrounds because I kind of like... I want map battles like Chrono Trigger. Just hoping for something there. Necro, I feel really iffy about going to fight that thing. Uh, optimize. Awesome. So let's go the other way. I don't think there are any random battles in the castle. I hope not. I'll take the Empire Soldier for sure. Easy peasy, definitely. My knight's Valor. Valor. Hmm. Alright, check it on up. Wait, what? That's not what I wanted. I gained a new skill, apparently. Ah, what does that do? Well, why would I ever want that? It's gonna attack me anyway, so... Get that back on. And... Blade Rush him. What? That was a disappointment. are all disappointments. Do not fail me, Blade Rush. Thank you. Well, that was easy, but it was took a long time. Oh, come on. Have some food. Some tea? No. Awesome strong juice. Needs a little bit more items in the game. I say that as I get another item. Okay, that's not too bad. Four different items. Wait. Yeah, only four different items in there. Not too bad, though. Where's the stairs at? Oh, they're right in the front. Of course they are. Let's try it out. Knight's Valor right away. Okay. Hmm. Not yet. Alright. Wait, did he just take that life? Hmm. I wonder how you do that. I tried the draining, but that didn't work. That works. We need more blade rush. Oh, he had an absorption s spell also. Alright. That, that, that's pretty cool that you can do that on enemies also. Let's just get it over with. Nice. So they're not too difficult, they just have a cool shield on them. 
So that's acceptable. Acceptable indeed. I can't remember if I checked these or not. I must have. Awesome. Strong juice. I wonder if any beds have anything. That'd be cool if it said, like, found something under the bed or something like that. I found a dirty magazine under his bed. What was this soldier doing? Just a funny idea. Right away. Good thing I have that. But that skull thing is persistent, but the others are not. Mm. Let's break his uh, barrier shield down. Shield barrier, yeah, whatever. It's broken. That's good. For us. I like having the Knight's Valor thing, that's, that's really helpful. I don't think I'd be able to beat this game without, or beat this area without it. Ours broke too. Need some more lip. Awesome. Good, 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 good indeed. Let me guess. Nope. Alright. I'll take an Empire Soldier on, sure. They're easier, but they take longer to fight. That's a weird pause on that one. Oh wow, never seen that one before. Let's get that back going. Back going. That's not proper English. Well, I am hungry, so I'll say that in my defense. It is lunchtime for me, so. Awesome. Told you, easy. Sounds like the way I can play guitar. That didn't have something on his head. This one didn't have the Yanfly event mini label on him. But you know, that's cool. That's cool. Just wasn't sure if he was going to attack or not, but, you know. So I am liking the game so far. It is a tad bit too difficult for me. But otherwise, it's um, really good. The battle system is very well... Um, what do you call it? It's balanced. That's something I don't have. I'm not really good with battle systems. I don't really like the whole battle system in 2D games. Because they're very boring. Nothing helps. For me, anyways. Uh, the mapping... I'm glad he used the pre-made maps because every time he seems to make his own, it doesn't look that great to me. Yeah, let's just attack. Uh, hmm. What else am I noticing? I'm not noticing a story still. So that's something I'm very much missing. Because I play RPG games for the story and, like, cool little 
features, even if they're like small features, I really love the features. And I said it last time I tried making this video before that video messed up. Uh, from what I've watched from Drifty, it seems that he also enjoys like features in the game, whether they're small or big. But he's more battle focused and I'm more uh, story oriented. So I, I love when there's a good story. That's what I play the game for. And it could be a story about anything. It doesn't have to be the story of the game itself. It could even be the story of the characters. So even NPCs, I just love backstories, stories of anything. Story of the world that you're playing the game. It's all good. I just really love the story in a game. All right, let's run away. What's up here? Alright, let's just get that over with. Let's get that going. But yeah, so far, like... It's just only minor stuff I'm seeing in the game so far. It's like... Just minor things, like not having the... The script on that one person so I could see what it was. I like, I kind of like... Since I'm so used to that being in the game now... Um, it not being in the game for one was kind of weird, but like I said, it's just minor stuff in the game so far, and that's kind of what I was expecting. Really, was it to be like really well made, but just like minor stuff. But just like Drifty does, uh, like how he critiques games as he goes on, I'm gonna be doing the same thing. But since this is my first video. I'm probably not going to be doing it as well, although the first time I did it, I was much more talkative. So that video mess just completely messed me up. And apparently I can't talk and play at the same time. I do have ADD, so... But yeah, there's not much I can, uh, like, s say that needs to be fixed. Like, there was a few, like, s like grammatical spelling errors, but it's so minor, and it's, it's kind of rare for, I would say, to see that. Yeah, let's attack him up. The only thing I would like to see is a big chunk of story at the very beginning. I love when games have huge stories right at the beginning, but not too much. It's a very weird thing. If I think, I think how I have it is good enough. I've been working on my game seven years. It better be good enough. The intro story that is. Mm. Nope, can't do that. Attack. But yeah, not too much story at the beginning and not too little. Just enough to get you liking the characters, because right away, I don't care about any of these characters. Like, I don't know anything about them. I don't even really care about the Driftwood or Tiana girl. Because there's not enough story, not enough background story, nothing that would make me go like, Oh no, they died, what will I do? Like, nothing. So that's why I like the stories, it helps you to like the players that you're playing as. And that's the one thing I really love about these first impression videos that I see Drifty doing. Um, Drifty does this and... Hmm, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, so when he does these first impression videos... Just come on over. When he does the first impression videos, he gives all this advice. And when I hear this advice, even though it's for other people who made the game, I take that advice for my own games and I fix things. And I'm guessing that's what other people might do also. And it's a very good thing, and that's what I want to do, is try to help anybody as much as possible. And that's why I'm... That's partly the reason why I'm doing the 
first impression videos also. The other reason is because they I love watching them so much that I want to make them. So that's why I kind of start this series of my own. And I want to start playing people's games more. I haven't played any... I have not played any RPG Maker MV games. This is the very first MV game I've played. And VX game play... I've only played two VX Ace games besides my own and my French game. So I need to start playing other people's games more. Um, to, you know, kind of help support other people's games in a way, like play it and be like, yeah, uh, I like this, but it needs to work on that, you know. I, I think I need to do that more. And my, me doing first impressions is my way of doing that, I think. But yeah, I think first impressions is very good help with people and with their game. I might be wrong about that, but I don't think I am. I will be doing videos about a minute or an hour long also, a little over an hour. Apparently my phone only records an hour's worth. I like how you can do that. Oh, it's on the same level, okay. Alright, let's get this other one. These enemies are here for a reason, I'm sure. Aw, uh, just one checkpoint away. Lip point. They're lip points, I gotta remember that. Lip, lip points. Aw, uh, no critical on that one? Too bad. Get the KV. I, I shouldn't have done this before lunch. I'm like really hungry right now, and I can hardly think properly. Hopefully, I am able to edit this video and get it up later today. Nope, not enough. Aww. Oh, come on, stop missing. That's good stuff. Aw, oh, nothing here. I want the goods, man. Alright. Yeah. That's actually good advice. Um, thousand is a lot, but I always like to up health, and for him, it'd be nice to see what his speed is. I'm gonna check out his stats. Wisdom, he doesn't need wisdom or willpower. Speed is alright. Vitality, that's isn't that just um endurance basically? Well I have it as endurance. He kinda names his the same as I do. I have strength. Vitality I have as endurance, and wisdom I have as something else, and willpower I have, I just call it will, and speed I actually have as speed, yes, because it's speed. It's normally called agility, but I, I call it speed, and for luck I call wisdom, so that's kind of cool. I'm going to up his strength. He, I think he'll need that. Good stuff. And let's save. Remember to rotate your saves. That's something I need to learn now that I'm doing 
LPs and such. I'm going to be doing this before I go to the throne room. I'm going to get everything I can. I'm gonna save that for an oh, you should have it where you can walk behind. That's a minor thing. But you need to be able to walk behind the chair. It's pretty easy to do. I look at everything because I have I have stuff on everything. You can look at everything in my game, but I have been working on it for seven years. I think he only worked on this game for a year or something. Like I would have a I would have it where you could look at everything, like flowers. There wouldn't be the mini event label above it, but you'd still be able to look at it and he'd be like, oh, flowers or something like that. That elite assassin wasn't there before. Interesting. Give up now, Mikhail. Mikhail. Your castle is overrun with the force of the Crimson Dawn Empire. Kneel before me, you fool of a king, and I'll make your death a painless one. You'll never take the kingdom while I live. That can be arranged. I'm guessing that's what it'll say. We don't plan on letting you live, so don't you worry about that. Yeah, pretty much. I'm promised a fortune for your head, and I've never... Well, there's a first time for everything. Arturis, thank you for coming. Just in the nick of time, too. Definitely. I came as soon as I got word. Don't worry, my lord. I will dispatch of this nuisance. Ha! We'll see about that. They're all, like, looking weird. Just different directions. Really weird. Well, with Knight's Valor, we will do decent enough. Oh, damn. He is pretty tough, though. I will be spamming Knight's Valor with this guy for sure. I'm gonna be needing it. Shuriken. Not much damage on that one, guy. He is a quick guy there. Definitely quick. I think I'm gonna play this until we see the two main characters again. I think they're the two main characters. It'll be a little bit over an hour, but I want to see them again. I want to see the story. There's still no real story yet. That's all I'm waiting for is a story. A little bit more of Knight's Valor. Awesome. And we can do Blade Rush again. Uh, can't do it again though, sadly. You can do it, Archerus! Some more Knight's Valor. Ah, we can do tech. Awesome. One more of those and everything will be hunky-dory. Get some Knight's Valor since it uh, looked like he was about to die. This is taking forever.
Gotta get the Knight Valor, or he would have died. On I almost died there. That was uh, that was close. I don't want to attack. Actually, let's just attack. He was just one hit away. I did Knight Valor just in case, you know. Protection. You always need protection. Thank you, Arturus. You have always been a faithful knight. But now the Coral Kingdom owes you more than ever. Please take this sword as a token of my gratitude. Prideful Longsword. Help us, Arturus. You're our only hope. I just already saved you. Uh, so nothing now? Let's equip the sword. Wrong one. Optimize. No, I don't want him to have the scale mail. I'm waiting that for that to be... There you go. I'm gonna give that to the main characters, unless they can't wear it, but that'd be weird. And I probably should actually save. Awesome. Oh, everything's back to normal. Should be able to walk behind that. That's an easy fix, too. Very easy. Men, we have suffered a great loss, but we are not defeated. I don't know why he's looking away from us when he's talking to him. That should probably be a... Hmm, can't think of the word. It's a check mark, though. That one makes sense, though. I guess we'll talk to them all. Uh, who do we have here? Chancellor. Yeah, probably. Anybody outside now? Uh, that was a weird one. Probably should put a weight on that. Or make it go like, oh, I, sh I don't want to go out there. Receptionist. Heard that Admantium deposits in the mountain near Silkwater Pass. That sounds familiar. Like I said, I don't remember much of what he made on this game. So, if the Crimson Dawn's Empire's castle is on the continent, the soldiers continue to mumble himself. That should have a direction fix. Yeah, that's what it is. That should have a direction fix also. These ones have them. I guess it was intentional then. But it feels like it should have had a direction fix. Wow. Well, let's see what is. Yeah, they do eat like bears, or worse. This music is... I don't really like this music here. Finally. You there! Soldier, lend a hand, please. I am a knight of the Coral Kingdom. My name is Arturus. What well, seems to be the problem? We have much happening right now. Arturus' eyes drift wood and Tiana up and down and attempts to gauge their prowess. I always feel it is weird when people do that, but it's okay, I kind of do the same. Our village was attacked by the Crimson Dawn Empire. We escaped through the sewers just south of here, there is a cave. Judging by the toy of sword you're carrying, I doubt you were born in the mountain slum. Tiana looks at Driftwood, but he ignores comment. Okay. Venting is a little bit off. She should be up one more. 
It seems they've planned their moves very strategically. But the castle was just hit by a hard by a group of assassins and necromancers. Many have fallen and more wounded. The feeling of solid solid solidarity is abundant, and I can see we all have suffered much at the hands of Crimson Dawn Empire. Eh, I didn't feel right. Bonk. The sound was off a bit. What happened to this girl? Tiana, are you okay? We were attacked by some mutant in the sewers. She took a couple strikes from the foul beast. I tried to protect her, but I failed. She looks pale. That, 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 that's spelled wrong. It's P-A-L-E. Pale, P-A-I-L is like a pale, like a bucket pale. Happens to the best of us. This appears to be more than just physical damage. Let's get her to the infirmary. That's correct. Infirmary, infirmary quickly. I fear she may need a special type of healing. Most definitely. The nurse said she has contracted a disease. She called it Marsh Decay. Sounds like something you would get in Morrowind. She'll be unable to move until we find some Cliff Eberroot. Eberroot. Eber. 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 Okay. Some root. Eb root. Eb. Let's just call it Eb root. And if we don't find it quick, she'll most likely die. I'll have to save her. I have to save her. I'll find this cliff root. I'm leaving right now. Please watch over her for me, archers. I can't let you go alone. The castle has been secured, and it'll likely be some time before we're struck by the Crimson Dawn Empire again. We've taken a large portion of their assassination squad, including one of their lead members. Your help is much appreciated. Thank you. I'll have a guard stand watch outside the room, and a nurse will keep a close eye on Tiana. Let's go. A little bit more of a story, so that's good. Yep. I don't know how long I've been recording now since, uh... Since my stuff is messing up, but, uh... Mm. So yeah, I'll play a tad bit more. I just want to see more story because I haven't seen enough story yet. Just not enough story. Still waiting for some story. But I am liking the game decently enough so far. Wait, where were we supposed to go? I don't think... Is there a journal? Said something about a mountain. The thick trees above are blocking all the sunlight from reaching the ground level. It looks like I'm running low on supplies. I might have to head south and leave the jungle again. It's probably time to visit town for supply the town for supplies. But before that I should grab a few more of these ath Atlas. Atlas. Random encounters. If it's going to be random encounters, I might just leave it off here. Because it's been quite a long enough. I don't. I don't know what else to say on this. I mean, it's been a pretty fun game. I might play it a bit more. Um, but I'm not sure when that will be. I, I don't think I'll record any of it, though. 
Nobody would want to see that. But yeah. The game has been pretty cool so far. Okay. Okay. But yeah, I like the game so far. And, um... This is probably where my character dies. Uh... Not much I can say for, like, help-wise. There's, like, a few different errors here and there. Um... There's a huge difficulty in some areas and not in others. Um, there's not enough story though. That's the main thing for me is like I didn't really see any of much of a story. I just like some random attack, but other than that it's just no story. I don't know much about the characters. I don't know anything about the characters. Um But the battle is very balanced. Um The map design is good when it was the pre-made maps. The, uh... Mm, like, the text, the speech, dialogue and stuff, that was decent. I only found, like, two or three errors, so that was pretty well done. The music is overall very good, especially the Chrono Trigger music. Uh, so overall, this was really well done. So, uh, yeah. Yanfi, RPG Maker, Zale, Soundtracks, and He May Works. I don't see Drift's name here, so I don't know if he made the game or not now. I'm just kidding. I know he made it. Um, but yeah, it was a great game, and if you guys would like to send your guys' games over to me to play, I shall do so. And I think I will have them up every Monday, more or less. So, uh, hope you guys enjoyed this very first video of First Impressions. Talk to you guys later. Love you all. Peace to you. And stay safe.